What is going on guys today? I am very excited to finally get my hands on this box. We have Thor, Lava and Thunder from Upper Deck. This set is relatively new, but I just I just never was able I was never really just got I never just got it, honestly. And I finally decided to pick it up. Got it from Dave and Adams here. So hoping to get something crazy from this box now you really want the autographs in here and especially from the two right there on the front you want jane foster and you want thor that's just who you want you want either of those two autographs you're probably looking at maybe a three four hundred dollar card autograph if you pack one of those and on the back you can also get pmgs which is nice but yeah there's a chris hemsworth right there i think i saw on ebay i was looking around some of the Jane Foster autographs, ridiculous. Absolutely ridiculous. I don't, oh no, she does. She does because she plays, I was going to say, I don't think she has autographs in any other sets, but she does because she played Padme Amidala in Star Wars and she has autographs in there. So I might put this in the back. I'm not going to lie. I might have to replace Spider-Man now. I might have to. I mean, this box art is just beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. But you got the three Spider-Mans back there. What would you rather see? Spider-Man, Scarlet Witch, or Thor Love and Thunder. Maybe I'll put it in the back. I don't know. I don't know. Maybe I got to change it up a little bit. But yeah, same layout as pretty much all the Marvel boxes I've opened. Six cards for back, 15 packs for box. Let's go. Let me know down below if you guys have opened up this product, how you liked it. Or so it looks like we got kind of a Doctor Strange or a kind of a, yeah, Doctor Strange Multiverse of Madness vibe. Kind of looks like the base as well. But we got Rocket Raccoon. Was he in that movie? Was he in Thor Love of Thunder? I'm not sure. I'm not sure if he was. We're starting out hot. We got the powered up Jane Foster. Starting out hot. There we go. And we got a we got a parallel back here. What is that? Who is that? I don't know. Love Silver? I have no idea who that is. I don't know. Oh, it's a statue. Sorry. That's a statue. I'm thinking it's White Vision for a second. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know what I was trying to go with there, but yeah. Let me know down below if you guys open this up, if you liked it, or if you're a fan of the movie. I know the movie didn't get the best of views, but I mean, I didn't hate it. The way they ended it, though, eh, eh, cut scene. The cut scene, I believe. So we got an omnipotence city. No idea what that is. What the hell is that? Is that a fwooper? That's a fwooper, bro. It's a fwooper. So these are not numbered. So those are, you get one per pack, I guess. But yeah, I think the, what was the end scene? What was the end credit scene? I want to say it was Jane Foster joining the Valkyries after she died. Sorry for the spoilers. Oops. Whoopsie daisies. Whoopsie daisies. We got Thor there. God Butcher is coming. He's coming. He's coming. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Looks like we got Tooth, Tooth, Tooth Nasher. Friends from work. That's cool. I like that back on that. And then we have another one of these, the legend of the, the Thor Odin son. Yeah. I don't know if Thor's gonna is Thor gonna be in Doesn't he have another movie coming out? Or am I tripping? I'm not sure. I don't even know what's coming out, to be honest with you. I don't know what what Marvel movies are coming out that are supposed to be hyped up. I know Deadpool and Wolverine just came out. But other than that, I mean what else is there? Doomsday doesn't come out for another couple years. So is this just a so that's not numbers. So that's just a regular base insert or regular silver insert. And we got, hey, we're here. Yeah, I don't know what Marvel stuff's coming out. I mean, Agatha all along is coming out. I'm going to watch episode, what is it, three or four tonight? Three or four tonight. I don't know. I'm enjoying it so far. I'm enjoying, I'm enjoying Agatha all along so far. I mean, I don't hate it. I think it's not bad. We got Jane Foster on the blue. And we got Rocket Raccoon on the silver base. Yeah, I don't hate it, but I know some people don't like it. A lot of people don't like it, but I, I'm not a big fan. I'm not, I'm not, I'm not, I didn't, I didn't mean that. I didn't, I said I'm not a big fan. I'm not a hater. I'm not a hater of it. But if you guys are looking for a good show, I'm also watching The Penguin at the moment. Honestly, amazing. Absolutely amazing. So it looks like we got new Asgard here. Travel the Rainbow, Travel in the Rainbow Bridge. Love the back on that. I'm not going to lie. And we got Thor there. Where he becomes naked and everybody's fucking looking at him. Okay, brother. Next pack here. Maybe I should do this way. 
You have to die in the battle. Uh, we got Drax there. <laughs> uh, looks like we got one of these. We got an acetate Chris Hemsworth as Ravager Thor, a film cell, the acetate film cell. So this, those are in the set as well. Some Marvel sets have them, some don't. I know the Spider-Man one that I opened has them in there. I don't know what else does, but usually the film cells are thicker. <laughs> we got Thor doing the book, Buskin splits. Got they're not here. Would love the pack. Ooh, oh my God, let's go. Please be autographed. I'll take it though. I will take it. We have a one of one. We have a one of one here. Not a true one of one in my opinion. I don't think these are true one of ones, but we have a one of one printing plate. Yeah, this is the yellow parallel of 26 Welcome Back. I honestly can't tell what's going on there, but it is a one of one technically. It says it on the back, as you can see. I, let me know what you guys think. Are printing, printing plates true one of ones? I honestly don't think they are. I'm not a big fan of printing plates. I don't think they're that special considering there's a couple parallels of each of each uh of each printing plate. You have different colors for each, so it's I don't I personally don't consider it a true 101, right? If I got a base card and it was a 101 parallel, I'd consider that a true 101, but honestly, when I'm uploading this video, I'm going to put in the title Pack the 101 just because why not i mean come at me if you don't agree but come at me seriously come at me so we got tessa thompson as valkyrie would be nice to get an autograph of her too i'm not sure if we're gonna get an autograph now because we got a 101 but that is cool i'm not gonna lie i've packed one printing plate other than that one and it was in a marvel box it was in the marvel annual box actually so we got another omni potent city there and we got thor on the back yeah so you get two autographs per case and most if not all of these boxes the ones that have the layout 15 packs per box six cards per pack usually it's two autographs per case but i did open up a wandavision case on the channel you should go check that out and i got three autographs in that cage was which is which is nice but we got tracks here on the friends from work and then we have a mantis on the silver yeah, three autographs in that case. One of them being an Agatha Harkness, which was very nice. I very much appreciated that one. We got Chris Hemsworth there. We got Thor on the base. It looks like we got another powered up of Jane Foster. Powered up there. And then we have a statue of Zeus. Wasn't Isn't Zeus supposed to be getting a movie too? I feel like Zeus is supposed to be getting a movie eventually at some point. Not not 100% sure though. We got Miek. And we got another friends from work. We got Taiki Watiti as Cork. We got Thor there. We got two packs left. Two packs left. Come on. Give me an autograph. Give me an autograph. Anyway, give me an autograph. No. We got Omnipotent City. And then we have... We got this one already, I think. But we got that silver on the end. Last pack. Last pack magic. Maybe, just maybe... Thor is on my side today. Honestly, I don't think so. But you could always dream, you know what I mean? It is not. So we got a regular silver parallel here. And then we have a... The, I don't know what they're called. I honestly don't know the specifics or the difference between those two. But we have no numbered card, actually. No numbered card in this box. But we did get a 101. So, I mean, you can't complain, honestly. I think I paid 60 or 70 bucks for this box. 101... I'm not going to complain. That is sick. I'll probably sell this on eBay immediately. So, yeah, that's the box. Thank you guys for watching. Stay tuned. Till next video. Bye.